ekonene ekonene episode 186 tukisema like subscribe hit the notification button tell a friend to tell a friend ndio yeah man na leo tuko na a legend in the house na hii jina si atu i don't think we misuse it ndio we don't we don't misuse that eh uh, yeah, so my tracks ni aje jo fiti man yani these days i'm being called legend we, we, <laughs> hey, buddha jo was not i think kwa waseka mimi wale old enough to see the journey yeah. i think your first song ilikuwa boda boda man yeah but it's funny before that yeah yeah i was producing some other artists yeah. they were called night shift and digital yeah yeah i don't know if you remember them they used to like they used to rap like twister yeah yeah so that was I, I, cuz i featured on one of their tracks yeah oh okay uh, and i think you know the producer so severe yeah so severe yeah, oh this thing on bad nani wala nguzi nini yeah pia niko best na yeah 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 hata ende ali produce yo intro ya iko nini yeah 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 eh wagani yeah yeah so yeah so i used to i used to record at his studio yeah yeah um we also did a track with yre but then now so the first mad tracks track here yeah, of course that was border border yeah yeah mm. did you expect it to go that big mm. at the time yeah at the time yeah Yeah. I don't know why I expected it to be big. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> I suppose if you're going to release a song, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you expect it to be big, isn't yeah. it? Right? Yeah. Oh, okay. But uh, yeah, so but then yeah, you know, we we hustled for that bigness. Yeah, yeah. yeah cuz yeah, we got almost... the whole hood to to request. Yeah, yeah. I love Kosa now uh, yeah. talking of that. Last yeah. Sunday could live. By the time you we were recording that song, Boda Boda Industry liko ndogo. Ama? Sindio? Like those no Man, I, I'm ahead of my time, bro. I'm, yeah. ahead, I'm ahead of my time. <laughs> <laughs> no, yeah. I, it, it was it was there though. It was yeah. it was yeah, it was. But but not so jo, have you noticed like squeezy mtu ameka tu chini like you have nothing to do sin patia boda. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, well, it wasn't it wasn't yeah, it wasn't it wasn't that big, but uh, uh, I I read it off of somebody's research paper. So it yeah. was oh. it was somebody's research paper and it was just lying on the table mm. and i saw border border and i it just i just couldn't get it out of my head i yeah i put it together i put it together with a different story yeah. so we yeah. gonna time to li to li shiwana mangata man we had gone west oh, 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 oh okay come resorts man yeah. the yeah. days of resorts mm. yeah. days of changes yeah. days of queues <laughs> Mm. Red oh. tech. <laughs> actually I'm old eh? <laughs> <laughs> this legend name is yeah, old. Yeah. <laughs> see, see like Raja like see yeah. oh, yeah. our uh, fourth floor last week ama z yeah. check him say fourth floor last week what do you mean? yeah like nini uh 40 <laughs> no mom third floor bad yeah uko third floor ah ni ko third floor bro uko 30 what see um 35 oh, uko 35 Yeah, yeah so, kuna nini research niko nafanya online niko like yeah, umse 1983 umse msa ile kumesa up from some podcast as a 1983 dude he is a jo he is a jo he is a jo i'm not an 83 yeah. I, was, I, was, i was still on uh, third floor yeah but i suppose you know even when i did border border i was 17 yeah oh shit i think yeah. that's the reason oh, why around mm. 18 there yeah. yeah i think that's why maybe i'm totally kuongeza so, yeah. people normally start at With 21, 20 23 hapo so mtu ina galiona um say he must have been 20 yeah. i think alifikiria hivyo uh, mm. uh, actually i must make a correction actually i was 18 maybe 19 yeah, yeah. 17 is when i started uh, djing oh, okay. when i left uh, toka chuo mm. and uh, so so una job una job bro yeah yeah yeah, yeah. alikuwa na crew inaitwa code red yeah, so yeah. that's when i joined and uh, mm. That, so I, uh, my journey in music i would say started when i was about 16 17 oh, okay. started okay. djing and stuff yeah, that's yeah. where the name matrax came from mm. yeah. so you can also dj yeah i think that's when i even met you yeah yeah cuz we used to do emergency room at yeah, uh, yeah, capital yeah, I remember. I remember. capital mm. fm mm, mm. those days everyone hated styles man they could go now he group one it was black duo yeah yeah na kumbuka na kumbuka styles used to do a lot of um mm. He, he used to critique a lot yeah, of music yeah, new music yeah, yeah, yeah so that time i think is when i met you guys you know mm, there was a mm. lot of uh, hip hop like a lot of it, the hip hop then i don't know it was more harder I'm yeah yeah, yeah it was it was plus it was a new concept i don't think it was harder mm. but it was a very new concept 
How so, new? I, I don't think it was that new. I just think it was ilikuwa imeshika at the time. I think yeah. it was newer when it was Kala Mashaka. Yeah, when yeah. it was Kala Mashaka days, that's when it mm, was new. Mm, but mm, by the mm. time now, Africa is coming and yeah, uh, yeah. I think now that time proper hip hop ilikuwa imeshika because mm, mm. kina Abbas as yeah, well. Yeah, yeah, mm. yeah. Uh, kina Black Duo, mm, Walanguzi, mm, 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 mm. Of course, Ukoflani. Yeah, yeah. So I think that's the time he shika yeah. around that time. Mm. Yeah, so. Arizona Samani, ilikuwa a new concept is according to me, this worker in Hali Shiri is hard. And it still does. Group, it yeah. still does millions of views. Bogi Genji, millions of views. And this no, shit is a, street. This shit is more street Bogi than Genji anything. I would put them more like that. They, to me, they're mm. more like Kina vibes. It's not quite. Yeah. Do you get what I'm saying? It's more like you kind know, mm. dance hall vibes. Yeah, 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 yeah feel. Yeah, yeah, Not yeah. quite hip hop. Uh, you uh, get what uh, I'm saying? Uh, yeah, uh, so so Mbogi Genja wouldn't put them there. Oh, if we're okay. talking about hip hop, hip hop yeah, now when yeah. you, you know, mm. when Kinawapi th- Buddha Blaze were doing their thing. Mm, mm. That was hip hop. Oh, but you still put that Gary Nengi shit. Like you look at how hard that song Gangster. was. Mm. And that shit has like I think the last time you check the Kokoma Five million views. I'm like <laughs> shit. Kenyan <laughs> fuck is this? With which song? Because Kitambo, Gary Nengi, Gary Nengi, uh, Mambaru, Subaru, Subaru ya Mambaru, Mambaru Naka. Ah yeah, 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 yeah. Of course. See, oh, like that's that all. That, when you say it like that, I know the yeah, song. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's not. Why? Why not Subaru ya Mambaru? Exactly. I think. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think that's what DJs get when yeah, they're on the yeah. request. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. You know. And Tazele Subaru. Ile Mbamba. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nobody really knows the titles. So you know what it means. Ngeri yeah. nengi. Si mm-hmm. nengi ni ingine. Ingine. Yeah. yeah. Mm-hmm. So so senior two story ya ku yes. whatever jo. But still isha ngia squeeze jo mimi na shindwa ku keep up. Mimi kuna feel nika ulikuwa na keep up. Like I used to listen to your songs and I'd be like just had some new shit from me. Yeah, you know early early on now when I did border border. Yeah, yeah. So <laughs> first of all before before all of that. Mm just uh, i i felt like i was a fly on the wall in the industry yeah, yeah, yeah. one on a v2 mob so just nikifuata bro nini nini the mm. days of ogopa mm. and so now the days of kina ogopa we had a discussion with my brother and my brother was talking about authenticity yeah, yeah. representing where you come from mm, mm. and so when i was doing border border i knew that i had to do the song in sheng yeah yeah how much sheng do i know about Mm, mm. about zero yeah, yeah. <laughs> about zero percent yeah, yeah, you're telling, yeah? and so yeah i sort yeah, of yeah. got into the habit of mm. getting to know what's uh, mm. and then i after that now when i did border border mm. is when i went to caliph mm. oh, and okay. i met the caliph guys mm, mm. and that's where i knew about now authenticity yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. when i saw that kind of reaction especially for jua mm. Uh, I remember the first time I performed. Mm. Yeah, was Zuko Jamu man. Mm. Eh, yeah. and he came out he was wearing his uh, he, I think he's also from Jamu. Yeah, so yeah, he was wearing, yeah, yeah, wearing yeah. he was wearing yeah. this green mm. blazer like he's representing his peeps. Mm. Yeah. Eh. Hey. <laughs> Maze, see that sent me by a research. Now yeah, research yeah. after that. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Hey, cuz it was crazy. You know Joe would just say like two or like he would say what two and it's the just you know just I'm goes telling you I'm like yeah. three people fainted. The, you know there was yeah. there's just yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it was just like yeah. <laughs> it's mm-hmm. just it was mm-hmm. pandemonium. So it sent me you know back to to research yeah, on what's yeah. going on mm. yeah so uh, that's how it keep oh but you are always like had that and i think he still has it yani mm. you like niniaki connection yake na the crowd is normally mm. wild yani mm. uh, yeah and i think mm. uh, i think it's something that caliph mm. generally just caliph yeah yeah as not even caliph as a so as, there's a record label yeah yeah but the culture of the record yeah. label mm, just the mm. culture around the record label so like mm. uh, you see the way cuz if people don't know ngoma you see if you ever see yeah, that yeah. ngoma yeah, thing yeah yeah and if you see the songs that they post mm, mm. the numbers yeah. and uh, is some of them are even vernacular uh, they have uh, a way of reaching to the masses it's mm. just the culture around the whole mm. caliph Yeah, thing that yeah. has a way of reaching to the masses. Yeah, yeah. But uh Pia, how are you ulu ezak pateje your balance cuz you are one guy we knew like this guy is uptown in quotes mm. but you connected with the hood and still never lost the uptown. <laughs> 
Because kuna wase waki connect na hii side moja they lose this other side. Mm. But you, you are able to get the balance. Hakuna msa likuwa like. Mm. Matrax anta likuwa fake. Mm. Likuwa gatu we ni wewe. Mm. Mm. Yeah because I'm not being fake. Yani, na, mm. I'm just being authentic. I yeah, think yeah. I understand the stories. Mm. Um, and I've always been interested in in culture. It's more a culture thing yeah, than it yeah. is a, a class thing. Mm, mm. For me, the way I look at it, it's okay, more okay. of a culture thing yeah, yeah. than it is a, a class yeah, yeah. kind of thing. Mm. So it's not at either I'm uptown or I'm downtown, okay, you know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's just yeah. mm. I had to represent. Yeah, I had to yeah. be authentic. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I had to be authentic to the Kenyan story mm. to what's going on over here. Mm. So, yeah, I didn't quite take it like uptown or downtown. Yeah, yeah. And uh, and, and also, you know, going to perform mm. um sikwa na chagua mashows man wherever yeah, yeah. the show is yani nimejipata even i think i've gone to kayole i've been mm. to mm. everywhere yani places ordinarily i wouldn't go <laughs> yeah, but <yeah>. because <laughs> 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 you know but mm. because you know it's for it's for the culture and it's for music yeah yeah road shows you just yeah. put yourself oh. on a track you you've, you've yeah, met yeah. at this place you've stopped here yeah. you know what i'm saying mm. Mm. Uh, was a club. Nah. Yeah. my clubs yeah, yeah. Kina umo. you know we did uh we did um we we had an endorsement from a drink called blue moon yeah yeah, yeah. if you remember mm. yeah, blue moon. Hey, yeah, hey, yeah. bro mm. You know, Blue Moon is for the masses. Yeah, yeah, yeah. is on the club, man. Oh, so many fika go go. Yeah, Madoni, Ma Umo, you know. There you'll find, there are nice clubs and nice chicks. Yeah, yeah. And then, it's just a nice vibe. Mad chicks. Mad, 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 you guys. Kiu jika wala na fraya yo story ya chicks. Bado thanks for kutokea talents at Jamu so. Jo na sema chaguangi. I didn't actually expect him to show up. Ara mimi siko na Johnny talent such man. Just the fact that I was going to panda stage for the first time. Yeah, yeah. I was so nervous. You know which year? Actually it was June, June 2008. Oh, June 2008. Eh? Well kwa well kwa 17 yote. Kwa yeah, I was 17. Uh, uh. What? Mm. Mm. So yeah, yeah. So you're like two years. So you're like 33. Yeah. yeah. No, I'm 32. 32. Oh, you see. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. That's yeah. what I'm saying. Yeah, so yeah, yeah, around when I was 19 is when all this is happening. Yeah, when all this is and happening. And I'm, I'm still in uni by the yeah, oh, time. Yeah. Uh, okay. And that time I, I never used to drink as well. It was a very interesting time yeah, for me. Yeah, yeah, mm. yeah. Uh, so, ulikuwa nava sama? Ukienda pale ukiwa sober tu. Of course I was sober. Mm. So those day, I, I never used to drink those days. So. Mm. Mm. Of course I was sober. It was, it was crazy man. But mm. jua jua it wash. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> But I think it's also I think a... that's the takeaway I got from that. Of course yeah. I was nervous when you get on stage yeah, it goes yeah, yeah, away yeah, yeah, yeah. when you're rocking with the crowd and when you actually realize they know your song. Oh man, oh yeah, that's I think why I was nervous. I didn't yeah, even uh, knew my song. Mm. Mm. Mm, then after that mazetu lichapa masho hadi chemil do you remember a place called chemil yeah river road. chemil eh? river road eh? <laughs> oh, <laughs> chapa like, show up for chemil it was a jam session yes yeah, yeah. uh, yeah. see yeah. to supremacy oh, okay. sound yeah, black, black supremacy, supremacy. Oh, black, yes, yes. yes black supremacy but see black supremacy was, was for, reggae um, ama they used to stop simple simon yeah. that hook mm. see walikuwa watu wa reggae so walikuwa mm. wana dupia nini jam so jam see now as tuna jini ni tuna jipox tu yeah Yeah it was reggae yeah. but now see tuna jipox me major we're just trying to get all the exposure we can oh. we went to that one we went to the F2 one mm-hmm. all the jam sessions you never got around CDs yeah. remember yeah. we had to take around CDs bro you never got hostile like reggae um stop show reggae na little babi hapa imagine lingia na boda boda like the bike yeah yeah, yeah. Oh, <laughs> I carried the bike <laughs> to Chemil. Yeah. <laughs> I tell you what, you open the door of Chemil like this, mm. una chapwana ki a wall who <laughs> of like, you know, Josh or two. Yeah, not true, not true. Crazy. It was uh, but it was it was it was for an the experience. Dream, for the dream. Yeah, liko liko experience fit man. Yeah, oh, yeah. okay. Because <laughs> there's a try to imagine ku interrupt us or reggae una letter hip hop. It takes a so, certain level of yeah. balls to do that yeah. Yeah. I imagine I had those balls man mm. yeah, yeah, I had yeah. to hear what I was doing <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> let's suppose mm. even you bro see you know yeah, yeah. who would stop you yeah na, na jua, na jua. so nini na hii ubeste na nani come uh, kuhapenaje cuz mm. like you and major 
mm. became like super tight mm. uh, ended up creating like one of the best ni super group eh? mm. council mm. Mm. so muli major your connection will happen aje so we came out at the same time i released border border he released um jana kuliendaje yeah, yeah. and so styles na clemoni my best eh? oh okay mm. okay mm. so Styles told Clemo, "Eh, hey, my bro is doing this." Mm, mm. Then Clemo told Styles, "Eh, hey, mm. uh, I have a guy who's doing this." Yeah, yeah. So we link them up. Mm. So when we when I went to that studio, now the studio was uh, on Forest Road. Yeah. Jim Weezy was there. Oh, okay. At that time Jim Weezy was a star yeah, man, yeah, you know, yeah, it was yeah, there yeah, yeah, yeah. under 18, under 18. Sitoe, kitu kidogo. Uh, it was uh, quite uh, hot. Mm, mm, mm. So but uh, for some reason Clemo Clemo trusted me with his machines. Yeah, oh, and okay. so we spent the night mm, there mm. and we did the round the sim chezo. Mm, mm. mm. After that, yeah, me and Major just became homies. Yeah. Uh, yeah. He'd show me his his side of town. Mm. I'd show him my side of town. Mm, mm. To my best man. Because eh vitu mshafanya pamoja tu. Na na the idea behind council mulia moja sasa. So when we were there that time Mm. There were a lot of artists around there were a lot of artists around mm. Mm. who were not getting the attention they deserve. Yeah, yeah. So when we started we were many. <laughs> I think mm. we were mm. like 12 guys yeah and we had Stu who and who and who and who. Mm. But they were just dropping off. Oh. They don't have they just don't have they don't yeah yeah hard to me you know what i'm saying like mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah they just don't have the energy yeah, yeah. so they just dropped off and it literally back it to me and major and kid k yeah yeah mm. oh uh, which song was this is a song bulifanya gamble kwa like new awili pekenyu yeah so kid k alikuwa from the beginning ama lingi after like one or two songs i think one of the like, most interesting things is uh, mm. Um yeah okay so which one twenzetu ama yeah, yeah i think i think twenzetu twenzetu kid twenze k two. produced it yeah oh he's the one who produced it he's the one who produced it yeah. kid k kid k i don't know was he really a rapper mm. oh, no. mm. i don't know i don't think he was i don't think he was inter- we had done a song i, I don't know i don't know about, i don't know if skamareza alikuwa sio huh? Skamare was there. See, yeah, he was yeah. there. Yeah. yeah. She was rapping, ama? Mm. Yeah, yeah. So, uh I'm on no, like okay, when you... so I don't think I, in hindsight I don't think Kid K was a rapper. Yeah. Yeah, <laughs> yeah when I now look back, yeah, I don't yeah. think uh, Kid K mm, I don't mm. think Kid K was a rapper. Mm. Um actually honestly, even even me, mm. not so much. Yeah. I wasn't I wasn't so much of a rapper. What would happen yeah. in the studio mm. is um First of all when I was a kid when I was in uh, Nikiwa Nikiwa high school yeah you know the way who was on your walls who would you put all your posters me when you go the usual eh? mm. some wutang like this mm. yeah but apart from that of course you go the girls to wake up to so this mm. <laughs> <laughs> left eye yeah you can make left eye by left eye na alia ah but apart from uh, left eye na alia of course you go wutang take a daka wutang poster mm. and I had guru Guru mm. a gangsta. So that was my my shit. So me imagine yangu ilikuwa ni my Dr. Dre, Timbaland, oh, Swiss Beats, okay, Pharrell. Okay. Mm. I was more into the production. Oh, production I was more side. into yeah. more more of the DJs. The, the, yeah. my wall was those kinds of people. Ah, okay, ah. of course Biggie had to be there. Yeah, yeah. Jigger. Yeah. Jigger. Mm, But mm. Uh, it was more producers. Mm. So even and I told you when I started I wanted to produce other artists. Mm. Me rapping was just because i used to practice it and then my brother told me you can actually rap yeah, so yeah, yeah. i ended up rapping oh, but okay. uh, yeah i was more like now if you play me a song right now mm. the first thing i listen to is the beat yeah, i won't yeah. even listen to the words mm, mm. i'll have to listen to the song like maybe three times kabla mm, mm. The, the words but the voice yeah. to me is an instrument so yeah, yeah, it's yeah. all part of the sonics mm, mm. the whole thing sounds mm, mm. yeah Yeah, yeah, yeah. Cuz I Nene, I think I don't know who else. I think we're going to discuss this with Zach. And mm. we were talking about even like rap then. Mm. 
and rap now mm-hmm. like what we've learned with time mm. i think it's your kitu mesema yeah the mm. voice mm. is an instrument because mm. uh mean if you look back even to the stuff i did this or siku i don't say i didn't know that mm-hmm. so what used to happen would be this because the excitement here yeah, rapping mm. so you'd be like umetoka tu umeandika rhymes too you go someone gives you any bit you just <laughs> record <laughs> you those <laughs> over which is wrong <laughs> Cause uh, unafa, uh, you should let the beat guide you on. Let's let's mm. do one, two, three. Mm. But mm. no, siku, see that you could own a studio in the house. It was like mkingi apa lem kona, kona wana. Ten minutes. Meli batao. You know, so that and 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 by the way, that's what angushes a lot of artists. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Studio time. Mm. <laughs> you have a a, a certain limit mm. upon which you must. Chomoka with a hit because yeah, yeah. you yeah. not even just chomoka with a song yeah, yeah. you have to <laughs> leave there with a hit because yeah, you spent yeah. chums yeah, yeah, yeah. on that studio time mm. so if you have two hours you have two hours to make a hit mm. and these things i'm telling you i have hundreds of songs mm. hundreds of songs that are just there, laying there, there. you yeah, get what yeah, i'm saying yeah, yeah. can you imagine all those hours mm. but before you get to the actual mm. banger yeah mm. which usually comes at 3 a.m i yeah, don't yeah. know why Mm. 3 a.m. is such a good time. Oh, mm. you're going to go at 3, eh? Yeah, well, okay, the, yeah, the council. Mm. Mm. This 3 a.m. Mm. Uh, it's also happened to me at like uh, 11 a.m. as well. Yeah. Yeah. Get down was 11 a.m. Oh, that oh, was okay. uh, mm. but a lot of uh, I don't know what happens at 3 in terms of creativity. Something mm. happens mm. at 3. A lot of mm. you hear a lot of uh, authors yeah, yeah. artists mm-hmm. 3 am is there something that happens even erections the devil's hour yeah. it's okay what even erections no seriously yeah yeah not to not really like you know that the morning <laughs> yeah the morning wood yeah, yeah. Uh, <laughs> but sasa nini the fact ulikuwa a producer mm. and then you are a rapper mm. Um, super producer super yeah 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 yeah, 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 yeah. yeah i got that from gitch boy man yeah, yeah. Oh, okay uh, mm. so um Ul, kuna time will try to explain your artist your story yeah like the voice is your instrument because i also think another thing that used to affect us was mm. our egos mm-hmm. like um uh, right now I'm an older guy and mm-hmm. kumbuka, but mm-hmm. kuna time nilipa i think homeboys gave me an opportunity to work with um anaitwa mm-hmm. nani mse msioka and i remember msioka had his ideas because no he's mm-hmm. a producer mm-hmm. so still me and ofanya hivi mm-hmm. but ego yako at that time kum sana ni anifundisha see now Then eventually when I come you hear about like the roots mm. like black thought the black thought that mm-hmm. we know mm-hmm. that super MC kuna time you andika kitu alafu kinania na mwambia si hapo change tu fanye and he does it because it's mm. for the song it's not for your ego mm. 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 yeah it's 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 all about it's all about the sonics of yeah. of it's all about the sonics of 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 the song mm. I, mm. me in most cases i really don't i don't i don't care what is what someone is saying yeah yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> i know it sounds bad eh? yeah yeah no no no, <laughs> no 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 in most cases i don't care what people are saying if this is if the instrument is being used properly ones are bouncing on the beat yeah, yeah. this is a discussion i was having with uh, uh with nameless yeah, we were yeah. talking about bounce because nameless is a master yeah, 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 <laughs> at yeah. bouncing on the beat mm. so we're just having a discussion on you know bouncing on the bouncing on the beat and stuff like that mm-hmm. yeah yeah but yeah we'd see we'd, we'd meet that's why we wouldn't we wouldn't record you yeah 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 eventually in his skills are well, like this could have been done so differently yeah but then you also look at the dynamics of those those days because when listen to some old school hip hop za kitambo mm. and i don't like them mm. and they are hits they are classics there mm. but those days there were too many restrictions but you know mm. in some cases that that formula works yeah yeah and but it works mm. if it if it's to work i think yeah. the best people to pull it off mm. ni wasewa river road Yeah, yeah. The River Road producers, you go to them with a song. Mm, you see now mm. the way you're, you're, you're saying you get a beat and you write to the beat. Yeah, yeah. Or so River Road you can go to them. Nataka ngoma yangu yende hivi na. And they make it, and they make it for you like that. Yeah, now yeah. the thing is finding a hit within those is, is oh, crazy. Oh, oh. Usually a hit starts with the beat. Mm-hmm. Yeah, una skia beat alafu uh, the beat is what now. Uh, from you na nini? Uh, alafu nini like um another thing like how are you able to 
get out of your brother's shadow si kwa si jaiski am sayota iko like matrax alifika yo level jo bro wake <laughs> I, I, uh, i just never was in his shadow in the first place yeah, i don't yeah. think so mm-hmm. 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 i know like, but he's he's my bro and he's a big influence yeah, yeah. into what i did yeah, but yeah. in the first place i was never in his shadow i never mm-hmm. used his Yeah, name. name to actually yeah. hello is this uh, ntv mm, yeah mm. this is uh, matrax i'm dj no yeah yeah <laughs> i never i never I, so it was all out of my own uh, efforts mm, it was just mm. just yeah all my own credit bro you, you I, i didn't want to be under that shadow yeah yeah, I, uh, yeah just oh, natural oh. <laughs> 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 yeah so um i love eh, cuz nini eh, cuz history ata nini ya tuku explore um history yake na aitwa uh, black duo mm. cuz i remember me one of the sessions cuz vile umesema they used to critique remember there was a, a session ile they wali shit on wali shit on nini <laughs> black duo ama cuz i remember that cuz They used to shit on a lot of time. people. It used to be on Friday nights. Capital Friday, FM. Eh? So Capital FM. Yeah, emergency yeah. room. No, on Friday emergency. nights. Yeah, yeah. Man, so of course we'd, we'd get new tracks. Yeah. So Capital FM, there was a box. I don't know if it's still there. Yeah, you know yeah. the way you drop your CDs? Yeah, <laughs> we used yeah. to drop CDs. So there was a box of mm. just CDs. Yeah, yeah. Uh, we'd pick a CD from there. Because now nobody's going to play those songs. By then nobody's going to play yeah, those, yeah. those tracks. Yeah, no, no, <laughs> those no. tracks. Mm. Mm. Those tracks no one is going to play them mm. if they're there they have to be ripped and put on the system yeah, <laughs> for them yeah. to be played right yeah, yeah. so no one is going to play them mm. so we'd pick any and would play oh randomly randomly yeah and oh. randomly it was black duo one time mm. but then also would have a lot of beef man there was a time kina bamboo mm. and kina nyashinsky and uh, kleptomaniacs yeah yeah they all came to to capital man it was mm. a, it was a whole bout but bamboo was alone mm. Mm. <laughs> yeah we had to, to <clears throat> he was talking he was just talking crap yeah yeah you, yeah, you yeah. know yeah, you know they, these kapuka guys you know what, what, what. Yeah, yeah. Kina guys of this this is it this hood yeah yeah they were so mother mm. uh they were in, they were in capital fm man it was uh it was quite some beef Oh, what's all pull up? All pull up, man. Oh, Kina shit. Kolo, yeah. Roba, Nyash. Mm. So we had to take bamboo out from the roof. There's a way uko capital you can go from the roof and go. Yeah. Down. Yeah. <laughs> so you had to take him down like that. It was well, quite a story. Oh, that's why bamboo found Jesus, eh? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he was swallowed by a whale. Oma, who was swallowed by a whale? Was it I, his wife? I think it's him or some mm. shit. Like mm. he does crazy shit. In mm. this past week alibonga jia the way KFC is a devilish food and people are asking like KFC <laughs> but um you know also his dad is a pastor oh i didn't know that i didn't know you didn't know mm-hmm. his dad is a pastor man so i don't know i don't know man but do you feel like the industry failed him um to some degree kuna time musa magaivo i know mm-hmm. the universe owes you nothing mm-hmm. but there are rappers i feel like the industry failed and he's one of those like he was a super mc I feel like he was dope as fuck in all languages eh? mm. and he was never able to reach the levels he wanted mm. and no kunkayo time kakikunukia ulikona okoka no kunka there was that period hapa mm. Kenya ilikuwa ga e this street shit is work mm. you go you go gospel no man me i think mm. i think rap mm. in Kenya yeah should be laced mm on dance hall beats. Oh okay. Mm. Mm. Yeah. yeah. Otherwise. <laughs> mm. So Omolo is probably like one of the few guys yeah, who yeah, gets yeah. away with it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But I think that rap should be laced on mm. dance hall beats. But, and that was the difference. But that's now when that whole discussion came from Kina Kalamashaka and yeah, Kina uh, Isa and the mm. difference and mm, mm. Uh, you understand all those differences that we're talking about yeah yeah even now kina our cardinal's new song kuna mm. bahalin if you hear that beat nicely it's a proper dance hall yeah yeah, yeah. and there's always that ka dance hall element even any zero sufuri hip hop mm. in its raw form and the way kina bambu were doing it and yeah, the time yeah, they were yeah. doing it with kina innovator mm. The masses couldn't yeah they couldn't digest it they couldn't digest it you mm, get mm, so mm. 
he just had to it was it was the wrong beats he was a mm. super mc yeah, on, yeah. on the wrong beats <laughs> okay. mm. the, i think uh Compe was one of those because yeah. it could it bounced yeah, it was bounced uh, yeah. it, it mm. bounced kidogo mm. but uh, mandugu digi. yeah mm. mandugu digi mm. and apparently i don't know whether it's true but apparently mandugu digi and gitch boy mm. have never really uh answered the question on who created the bounce because the bounce was a whole time i think a yeah. whole decade yeah, yeah. <laughs> the oh, yeah. bounce was like from 2005 to like yeah, 2000, yeah, yeah. <laughs> 2000 mm. and like 13 or something mm-hmm. and um the first track was the bamzi one yeah, yeah. this is called the bounce this is mm-hmm. so mm-hmm. then it became a genre mm. which now burst in a um, that song hapo vipi hapo sa hapo vipi hapo sa became a G. whole genre of music eh? mm, but no mm. one has really answered the question who came up with the oh. bounce interesting eh? yeah, mm. yeah 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 uh, okay is to the nene yeah beats cuz I, i i okay another thing of uh, move kiria jake i don't know mm. ukiangalia okay, 80s american 80s hip hop mm. had a lot of samples from their own music nakumbuka mm. mm. but sisi Mm. I feel like we skipped that steps. Mm. Juko le ndo unakibonga jua beats. Mm. Like beats that was equal na any mushrooms influence mm. or mm. any maroon. Oh, yeah, I yeah. see what you're saying. So it was like this very strange sound. What unashindo? Mm. Boop 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 boop. Alafu mnaongea juu hiyo ni hii ni muziki kwa. Mm. I think because mm. so um the mushrooms I think were a bit too old. The yeah. what was really hot yeah. at the time to be sampled mm. was Kina Red Rat. Yeah, Kina yeah. Chaka Dema suppliers yeah, yeah, yeah. and that was what was sampled. Do you get what mm-hmm. I'm saying? Kina mm-hmm. Ogopa even yeah. now let's say the whole of Uganda mm. <laughs> their whole industry yeah. is based of a, a thing that Ogopa did. Mm. Mm. Chaka the Chaka Dema suppliers mm. bam bam beat. Mm. Yeah, and that yeah. just made the whole industry. We had a couple of songs here Kina Gidurai and stuff yeah, that yeah, that yeah, fought yeah. that sort of Yeah, thing yeah, and yeah. then we branched off but we branched off still in the dance hall direction. Mm, mm. So instead of sampling kind of the mushrooms we sampled dance hall. Yeah, yeah. Mm, that was what was more Yeah, yeah because got na penda reggae. reggae <laughs> so, exactly. So that uh, so uh. we didn't quite skip it. We just and music is really inspired from everywhere. Bro, yeah, man. Yeah, yeah, uh, kind yeah. of the, the the mushrooms I don't know how to mm. But I did it. Cindy, I did with Kinas Kamarez. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, you cuz that that sample you got. What was? What that whatever. You put me on the spot now. Yeah. I can't even remember. Hey, <laughs> <laughs> cuz that that shit was. Yeah. That shit was fine. Uh, uh, yeah, was it was yeah, it was um I don't know, maybe. Too. And uh, and who played the guitar? Ama it's, it's, it's a guitar that whatever it's. I'm not just doing instruments and this guy is doing it. Prince you know me so me you know me I'm a guy who, who came from hip hop me I was sampling bro yeah yeah, mm. yeah yeah the guy who played the guitar is the original guy who played oh, the guitar is original oh. <laughs> the original guy yeah. the guy who played the yeah. now you gonna make can, can I go on my phone and find out who that yes it's a silly thing yeah but uh, yeah. yeah and uh, I've 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 sampled quite a bit because mm, mm. I'm a hip hop guy. Yeah yeah yeah. Uh, that's that's I saw I sample quite a bit even mm, bablas mm. and stuff. Yeah. yeah. Mm. Uh but son any uh still to stick na your your generation when I feel apart from the beats what else do you feel like made that generation not be what it was supposed to be because don't forget Tafsiri he was very big. Mm. And then from Tafsiri he it's like it's downhill mm. after Apo. Mm. I think Tafsiri then songa songa mm. hapa ni kueleze. Mm. You see then pff, mm. downhill Mm. The fact that <clears throat> Africans have always said this. Yeah. Africans um our our our, our roots musically. Yeah. So white people mm. are able to go and listen to music and sit down yeah, and yeah. listen to yeah. music. Mm-hmm. Africans wherever music was playing we are dancing. Yeah, rhythm. And so can tafsiri he and what followed after yeah. was not danceable enough. It oh. wasn't it wasn't for the clubs. Mm-hmm. So the songs if you if even now mm. catch catch someone like Major on a track that's not for the club. Yeah, I, yeah. I think the last track he did that was not for the club yeah, was yeah. probably like uh, what was that song? How can I forget? Yeah, yeah. I love that song. The song ah uh, 
asante majengo yeah, yeah, you yeah. get what i'm saying that yeah, they, yeah. but after that and even now mm. the songs that are hitting are yeah. for the club mm. and mm-hmm. so when you no one really like i'm saying no one really wants to hear what you're saying yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's yeah, just yeah, how it yeah. sounds mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. so that's what let down a lot of rappers mm-hmm. they decided to yeah, do tracks that are see. not danceable mm-hmm. now we need to sit down and listen mm-hmm. but it's such a white person thing to just sit down yeah yeah and listen mm-hmm. <laughs> and not dance woman an african cuz still no joma rap was still they could uh, the, uh, we could how, listen how they how they got mm-hmm. away with it is the whole b-boy culture yeah, so the yeah. b-boy culture was fueling the dance yeah, for them yeah. so the songs can be played in the club because of the b-boy culture mm-hmm. and mm-hmm. the way the b-boy culture has uh, mm-hmm. has penetrated the dance so yeah. now they can dance to it in the club but for us mm-hmm. yeah see nini red rat Mm. Ah, apart from Red Rat, Red Rat yani tumetoka kuona uh, Alusma Belek and Ngoma Manoki Twist West. Alafu na all of a sudden you enter to use our heads. Exactly. Mm. You can, yeah. Africans man, we have to dance. You can't quite at just sit down and uh, and listen mm. to to a song. Mm. Ah, but then there are some songs that uh, get, that cut across like Giuliani. Yeah, yeah. Giuliani is one of those people you can't quite dance to his music but yeah, just the yeah. message, yeah. Mm, mm, mm. The message was quite deep. Mm. But I think Giuliani Pierre cuz the message was attached to Jesus. If it mm. was just a message mm. cuz I think Ukoflani had the message. <laughs> but the message was coming without Jesus. Like you know Jesus Yesu hapo. Yeah, by the yeah, way. Yeah, yeah. Mm. Yeah. Mm. So, yeah, I mean, I mean Yeah but, uh, so even now Giuliani I, I don't hear him is he releasing anything are you a fan it's been it's been a minute yeah, since me, I'm looking for it. him but uh, Giuliani me have yeah. beats man I've been making beats recently yeah 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 mm. I think it's cuz you know, that rapper ish stays in you so he's I, of course I'm sure he's been writing So, yeah man uh, uh, and and pr- probably doing some big ngo stuff man that's yeah, one of those yeah. guys yeah, <laughs> you never yeah, count yeah. him out he just mm-hmm, yeah mm-hmm. <laughs> he's been nominated for a grammy yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you, know, you know what i say like mm-hmm. which song <laughs> for, for his work in <laughs> copenhagen <laughs> for his work in the yeah, you know what i'm saying yeah, yeah, i just have uh, some connections with the wazungus man mm-hmm. i don't know how i'm it's the dreads you tell us Ah uh, misi juu jo mimi onipendi jo. Ala <laughs> 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 uh, do, do you feel like uh, at some point school kuna hiyo over reliance on corporates to push you to the next level. Do you feel like at some point it was that because I feel like right now artists are more independent but of course it's because of the internet. The internet mm. has opened mm. walls zile azikuwa. Mm. But vile tu umepata an example ya Juliani. Mm. I feel like at some point Juliani was releasing so much music mm. and then the corporate world came and kaka slow down. Mm, I think so. Mm. And and uh, but I think the corporate world accepted him even more than even the clubs. Yeah, yeah. You know would play a few and mm. even i think the songs that were playing that were Giuliani's the 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 beat was kidogo dance allish yeah, sort yeah. of had this wakadinali vibe mm, mm. but uh, yeah he was accepted more by the the corporate for us guys who are doing genge as to this is in my show my road shows yeah, yeah, na yeah, shows yeah, yeah. na clubs na nini mm, mm. corporate akikam alhamdulillah yeah yeah and i think to you know what i say to go up bro uh, you know we d- but we don't rely on the the corporates, yeah, the corporates. we, didn't, we mm. didn't quite rely on the corporates but there were the artists that relied on the corporates kina even kina buda blaze i suppose is that is that corporate the ngos yeah, yeah. Also, even mm, you mm. you have a, you have an in on this toro mwaf should be telling us the in on this toro you <laughs> are <laughs> even with kina k bro no. that's that whole world we're talking about <laughs> but you know one not corporate uh, kenon was just um i think yali kuja when why did it feel so ngo ben, that benson track? and hedges like they used to be the Benson and Hedges rap battles mm-hmm. so time to Kenya na kakuja mm. alafu to kanini but like we NGO <laughs> <laughs> that's, 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 that's on, true or not it had an NGO vibe it had an, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Was like <laughs> it took an NGO for most people to familiarize with rap yeah, uh, yeah that mm. the events yeah cuz yeah kitu kama wapi for example like even this guy Emmanuel Jal yeah, yeah. you know yeah, quite Jal. NGO mm-hmm. there are mm-hmm. those mm-hmm. you know NGO mm-hmm. level now that's the one I'm saying for corporate those ones now yeah yeah mm-hmm. the NGO level tracks bro 
Yeah. <laughs> I should try an NGO level there. In Agakuna do, kina MDQ. MDQ and GO level, man. I'm telling you, I don't know why I feel like MDQ is also NGO level. Z- like. Z- MDQ mm. is just uh, that girl is just uh, But she has an in on these um, on these NGOs as well. She just bro. lives with corporates. Man like it's yeah. I love the Zach kind of famous story yake uh, she was offered uh at Nini Nunoliwe. We should get a story. I don't want to ask if it how true that story is. Uh, blankets are white. Yeah. In only on a CK. Yeah. The story for CK. Mm. Yeah, man. I mean, I, I, I had that story. Yeah. Pure yeah. joy um, can I think CK felt like he owned it. Yeah, yeah. Because he was pushing it from mm. capital. Mm-hmm. When he realized he doesn't own it, mm. that's when he started blankets and I mean uh, Koroga, Koroga, Koroga Festival. Mm, mm. When he realized it's not actually his. At mm. first, because it was coming from capital, he was like, Yeah, you know, blankets are white, it's yeah. mine. Yeah. Yeah. You know, yeah. Oh, we have this Mudoni, she's a very she's a wonderful girl. Huh? <laughs> but he found out it's not his. Yeah, what yeah. do you mean? Uh, <laughs> I love your time, ours. I think. <laughs> 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 for him being told by because that when she was in her 20s eh? mm. being told by a girl in her 20s no mm. like I'm not selling this to you like, you, are, you are a billionaire you'd never understand like who are you going to no there is a certain for ego sure. that comes with wealth eh? for sure and and, mm. and, it, and, and even me I'd, I'd, I'd probably be the same bro. <laughs> I'd probably <laughs> and I'd have probably started Koroga Festival just to rival <laughs> yeah, if yeah. I had that kind of money just yeah. just so what do you mean you say how you are no uh, uh, no hello mm. Jorge <laughs> but now is it still there Koroga Koroga I mean the way I feel about uh, or capital mm. is, um, I, I suppose now the new owners have to take mm-hmm. <laughs> charge. You get mm-hmm. the new owners have to bring in their own spice. That was all CK's spice. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That was CK's way of doing things. So I, mm-hmm. I suppose now, capital has to sort of mm-hmm. take mm-hmm. ownership. Now, yeah. now, now these new owners. Mm. The they they have me? to start their own events. It doesn't quite have to be Koroga, but yeah, Capitol's yeah, yeah. events have to. Uh, yeah, of course, it's still there. It's their yeah, name, it's but it's I, they're not doing it. I don't know whether they do it. As in, see the new one as Nihi Dotake. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. They have to take. They have to take ownership. <laughs> they have to take ownership and you know, from do that. Uh, either continue Koroga or do new events. You know, just right, sort of um, hype up Capital mm. back to its. Uh, Mm. No, why you meet? Did you ever meet uh, CK? I did, man. He was such a great guy, man. Yeah, yeah, funny yeah. guy, funny mm, guy mm, in mm. person, man. Very funny guy. Mm. But I'm there uh, uh, at the end of it, you know. He yeah, end up yeah. giving you advice. No, no, you know. Mm, mm. Mm. It was a, mm. it was a very, he was a very cool guy. Yeah, met him. I, uh, to be honest, met him like twice. Yeah, appear mm. me. I think it's twice. Mm. Um, but I can't say uh, Kenya night. Mm. Kenya night. Yeah, this guy. Too. It's to be run by my mm. So the same day, I got a job here mm. at y- YFM. Because mm. I got my job from Apple. Mm. Limitigi. Mm. Uh, take mm. my card, of course. <laughs> after that, <laughs> after that, you know. And it was like a black card with gold. It was, yeah. it was quite a fancy card, yeah. I remember. I, remember and I, remember. <laughs> card. I think I tried to call it. And it didn't pick up, of course. <laughs> like, <laughs> not sure. uh-huh. So cool, because I think he was tipsy. Oh, this is the second time he could meet. It's just a story a friend of ours told mm, us. Mm. Like they went to a club. Mm. Uh, another club. They went for lunch mm. at a place where Kirubi was. Mm. And one of them was shouting. Mm. Hey, you see At Kirubi, I to say, I'm read this volume. Mm. read this volume. The next thing is, well, come on, come boy. He's already paid your bills. Mm. Just take the nini. <laughs> just just take get the fuck. Yeah, <laughs> 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 yeah. 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 <laughs> then got the bill, kubwa. Yeah. Mm. It's like thirty. Thirty k is a lot of money for us. Eh? Yeah. Yeah. I live here because I'm too so I want to live. So I think they didn't even finish their food. Go pull on a grab a piece of chicken. Kienda, kienda inch. He did. What are you eating for thirty k, bro? Uh, it was an expensive place. <laughs> okay, so like those so on a lot of places. Ah, eh? bro, mm. yeah, yeah, yeah. I think mm. maybe drinks plus what? Maybe a wine is 16,000. Mm. 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 You're making too much noise. Yeah. Yeah, you can bro. smell the poverty. Yeah, friends, bro. 
Mm. Your destination is on the left. Mm. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> 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 how you can cash out. Mm. Yeah, yeah. Mm. And your money na come now. It comes with its own. And also, Mambuchi. yeah, also with its I feel like I imagine this is a conspiracy theory. Me I feel like in uh, Kalamashaka were too great. I feel like they were I think th- I think they were poisoned. Mm, 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 mm. I think they were poisoned because yeah. I think Kalamashaka had the potential of being like mau mau like proper mau mau it was, yeah, it, it yeah, was yeah. a movement it was n- not even a group of rappers mm, mm, anymore it was mm. <laughs> poison it was how? a movement and i think they were they were drugged and all sorts of things they were poisoned mm. they were working on drugs they had yeah, to mm. sort of scatter that this thing it was mm, just too mm. much mm. that's my own yeah, yeah, conspiracy theory that, that that comes to the ile conspiracy uh, conspiracy theory must get you about male or male was killed by the cia mm. i'm like i loved bob male yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm. But he died of cancer. Yeah. To see, 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 Yeah, just that's my own conspiracy uh, theory. Uh, uh. <laughs> don't don't side... take it as truth. This is my conspiracy mm. theory. Because <laughs> yeah, me, just... kwa it's just the fame mm. and the money. Because mm. mm. they got into money very fast. Eh? Mm. I love if you get into money and you're seeing what the Americans are doing, mm. you might want to copy. And mm. then, yeah. Cause Even the DMX may I feel the same way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They were drugged. These are, these are people who are larger. You know, there are those... Yeah. Um, There are those personalities that are just large. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, so we feel come a. Even the, DMX was he was set up. I think they mm. were all just set up. They were yeah. all set up drug wise, They were mm, just too mm, big. Mm. Mm. Uh, but then, uh, with that, I'd have to rewind with you. You are um, 19 years old. Eh? Mm. The biggest check ulwe ipata ukianza ilikuwa pesanga pi. When I was 19. Ukio ukio mto i like. The biggest check ulo ipata ukianza anza. So five. Hmm? five G's. You are uh, oh, five G's. <laughs> five uh, G's. Uh, but yeah, I'm sure you wasted it, ama. So you wasted it on bullshit, ama. What did you do with it? Because kila natai kuonyesha ni, it's all about money management. Like if you don't manage it well at some point when it's not there, it can stress you. Mpaka. Bro, me, money management, I was the worst, bro. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I was the worst, and I was the worst until like 2017, bro. Yeah. <laughs> <I> was, <laughs> yeah. Mm. Oh, okay. I was the worst, bro. Mm. Money management, ni, ni manza juzi juzi, bro. Yeah, kwa ni, 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 I think 2017. I was too young. I didn't, I was too young. Mm. I, did, I also, I was, I was yeah, really yeah, young. Yeah, so at yeah. 19, all you want to do. Mm, mm. Is all you wanna do is party. Yeah, some drinks and, and you wanna get them shot in. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Some drinks and, and some condoms. Mas eh? <laughs> 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 any anywhere you go it looks like a trap house, bro. Mume lala uko meke shariri wake up is booties chile. Yeah, that's mad. So yeah, money management it can it can mess you up. So you're saying that's what messed up all these guys. Yeah, hey, nafikiri cause I don't know kosha iske the story but the story is up on 1998 eh? wali and uh, I think st- still through Benson and Hedges they went mm. to Nigeria mm. and they made a lot of money mm. i don't know how true that is mm. and when they came back mm. apparently they were living at Yuskubadu going to a grand regency cuz they were like what yeah, living living up or lishi up for some nice. time mm. Mm. Wow. how much mm. you can just be stepping on tiles <laughs> yeah. see bro <laughs> the like hotel in there mm. man yeah. probably like a night was probably like 15 g's mm. a night mm. eh? afuku mkeo ni na yuko 98 huko Mm. Wow. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> <spice. laughs> yeah. Yo, that's shit. Uh, so na fikiri kuna kwa kana hiyo hiyo shock ya. I think also yeah uh, I don't know whether there is any edu- tell an NGO to do this yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Damn, I wish I wish is an NGO but yeah, let's try. Let's see. Eh, ni ambia fanya. <laughs> uh, yeah education you know yeah uh, yeah, yeah. Mm. i think in 
and they've come again the fourth time. These guys are really big in our cardinali. Yeah, I yeah. feel like they uh, they look like the same to me. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Do you get mm. what I mean? Mm. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, if, if they can just get the education, man, if you can mm. just tell. Mm. Yeah, mm. man, so that they can last. If they're kunyoing all their chums, mm. you know, it's, mm. it's not I think I've had Casco wrong, Nishaskin, and Yaki Bonga Joe shit. What's his name? Ska. I think mm. them they are more tech, uh, they're, they're more business savvy. They are more business savvy. Yeah. Uh-huh. Mm. Yeah, and I think anybody um, else like even kina uh, the young ones kina trio mm, and whoever mm, mm. It, it can it can get even so that's why even right now I've taken like a break here and it, it's mm. just madness. When you when you when you wake up from the madness, bro, yeah, just yeah, like yeah, you got to yeah, yeah. you got to take a chill pill kidogo. Mm. Not but, that I don't like music, but mm, uh, mm. but true, true has his mom by his side. I think that helps. Uh-huh. I think it keeps you grounded. Uh-huh. to a certain level mm-hmm. um Pia, so do you remember the his infamous thing of i don't live with my mom my mom lives with me that oh. means with that comes i think a certain level of could you have to handle you, money because yeah. you're taking mm-hmm. care of bills exactly mm-hmm. 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 exactly ah man but no need for ngo bro if these guys yeah. have the yeah, yeah, yeah i think know. this newer generation mm-hmm. i feel like they are more in control mm-hmm. yeah i feel kuna yo a certain level of control now for maybe streaming has also helped mm. like maybe they don't need to worry about mm. bullshit like mm. by bullshit i mean things like rent mm. Mm. Japa, maybe rent to talk from youtube mm. maybe steam i talk from spotify i'm not really on any i'm not really on social media nikulize do guys mm. make money from tiktok uh there are those who do but not musicians but hey, I'm an influencer in uh, the ads of this world so yeah. it's just from the it's influencer ju- it's just from the ads Yeah, like yeah. it's just from brand placement. Yeah, yeah brand yeah. I see at Lipwe. Apa Kenya. No, so also TikTok d- doesn't actually mm. pay. Yeah. So it's even even the uh, terms you know, terms and conditions eh. Uh, mm. Yeah. You know it's a whole new thing for me, mommy. It wasn't there when I see me me I I watch at around 2020. Yeah, yeah. So now seeing all this happening now mm, man I'm mm, just like mm, ah mm. it's interesting. And so they're paid per view. Uh kwa so say mm. i'm i'm pembe mm. flower yeah i want to oh, put it zizi. so is it per view mm. do i pay like muna, muna, muna for every view is a bomb zizi munaskizana see they they look at the back end munaangalia mm-hmm. mnaona this is your reach mm. this is your what this mm. is your what mm. and then we give you a certain sum mm. and then we hope hii kitu ile umetu brand mm. it <coughs> reach the same numbers it mm. the same mm. numbers mm. Yeah, but it's not per view or mapa so it's whatever. just in the hopes yeah yeah like if it's a successful campaign mm. you know enza kuwa super successful i think mm. it's a jemonde alipatega story liko interesting sana there's this ad they did for a certain company mm. and the company didn't like it mm. so but so they posted it before and they kwa kampuni mm. so the company on you know kwa like you jinga gani me post kitu like you after three days you kokoma 1 million what yeah so he did what he was supposed to do yeah but they didn't even get paid Uh, I don't even think if they got paid but yes where that's where the corporate world will let where they yeah. start dictating what you should do when yes. they came to you I think and and I was going to say I think mm. also mm. when it comes to the comedians because I see the the larger percent of the yeah, yeah, yeah. influencers mm. Eh? Yeah, mm. comedians yes, yes. have you noticed when they're paid mm. to do content it's not as funny Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's like, like when yeah. they're forced mm, it's mm, but when mm. they do when they just do something authentic it's yeah, really yeah, funny it's but really funny mm. Mm. but mm. It's, it's, mm. it's, it's, it's all in the numbers bro yeah because now the corporate guy has to approve like, mm. yeah, yeah, this is funny <laughs> <laughs> retract this yeah. i say it's funny yeah. <laughs> 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 uh, <laughs> Jabby, <laughs> this is funny <laughs> uh, you see it comes with that key corporate machine whatever because you're good comedy Uh, at some uh, uh some point comes at an, the expense of someone else some mm. award na corporates mm. wengine nataka ku play clean and neutral na iwezi wa kivo so inakuwa inakuwa ni tricky uh, so uh, umeponga jua break so when will take break <coughs> first it started out as just for my spirit mm mm, mm. mm. Hey, it was just uh, it was just it was quite it was overwhelming Mm, mm. Yeah, the nights and just the lifestyle, bro. Mm, mm. Mm. Yeah. Just kidogo overwhelming. Yeah. And uh, at the same time, I've become a parent and yeah, etc. Yeah. You know. Mm, so mm. Um, now I wasn't. 
ah, I wasn't feeling it, bro. Mm. I just wasn't. I don't even know what to say. I just wasn't feeling it. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And uh, so at this, at the same time, though, there was something that happened eh? mm. in 2017. Mm. Mm. Uh, my sister passed away, mm. and I remember mm. at the end of the year, we had three shows that night. This mm-hmm. is New Year's. So 2018, <laughs> Amma, 2017. Now yeah. going into 2017, going into 2018. Yeah, yeah. And I'm looking up at the sky and mm. all these fireworks. Mm, mm. And to me, it was like the end of something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And, we, and I just turned by there, I just turned 30. Mm, mm. So I was looking and it was like the end of something. It was like, mm. there was something new happening in me. I don't know how to explain mm, it. Yeah. I, yeah, don't, yeah. I don't want to sound creepy, but something, yeah, yeah, yeah. something was happening when mm. those fireworks were, you know, it's like mm, a movie. Mm, mm. It's like mm. the end of, mm. Mm, something mm, for me mm. and something new happening mm. from that point onwards in the feeling come on just come on to get these things done mm. get to the interview get to the video shoot look for the man yes yeah, you yeah. do this and do and look on just come on sana by the time yani 2020 came it just grinded to a halt by itself together with covid mm, mm, <laughs> you get mm. and then i felt free and i was like z I'm not, but I have songs yeah. which I like jamming to. So I mm. just post them on uh, on Apple Music. I still do. Yeah, oh, okay. I, like I post them on Apple Music. When you're scared, I'm scared. But now the mm. whole the whole life of trying to market it, market and it, and mm. push it, you know, push it. You're at this club doing this with this DJ, and uh, mm. then mm. we're doing uh, and hosting this. Ah, yeah, okay, okay. It had uh, it had issued. Mm. Now, um, I'm, I, I suppose I'm just talking about what comes with the territory yeah, yeah. <laughs> but the actual music mm. i love it i'm still making tracks mm, mm, i'm mm. actually thinking of uh, i'm actually not thinking i'm yeah. doing a, i'm doing an, a, a project mm, mm. but i i, I don't want to rap yeah, i won't yeah. be i won't be the focus mm. but but the music will be my music oh you want like other people yeah yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. newer artists are my... newer 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 man mm, mm. Uh, oh mm. okay so mm. uh, if and I, I'll say it here if if I if I can get uh, Father Mo, yeah, yeah. Saru, mm, mm. Brandy Minor, yeah, yeah, mm-hmm. yeah. Nikita Kering, mm. Mm. and if and, and and if none of them comes through, then I'll call more Africa. But Nani, Nani is it's right in your alley. Nani to Nani abo, Nani to Nikita, Nikita is just a ring. Uh, yeah. Why? She's uh, uptown. You uh, see uh, her pay uptown. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You remember that Karege song? Uptown girl. <laughs> na, 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 na. Mm-hmm. Yeah, she's an uptown girl. But, uh, so, uh, cause, uh, I think there's a charm for uptown, uptown yeah, people. Yeah, let's like, like a WhatsApp group. We had to go to no sheng allowed. And sheng We have a country, we have a country club. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, so could I hear any? Uh, 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 was that chua? Chua lenda kapi? Uh, Just had to dig into life, sasa. Yeah? Saint Andrews. Saint Andrews. I was in Rusinga. Mm. Then I went to Saint Andrews. Oh. Mm. Rusinga wa kapi? Is a jo sinole? Cause I think I see the bus. I've seen the bus, but Kangware. yeah, yeah. I've sent Andrews ni le Turi, the Turi. Yeah, mm. Oh, that one was Molo. Where? It's in Molo. Turi, yeah, it's a town just before mm, you get to Molo after El mm, Bago. Mm, mm. 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 So, uh, Apo, like Primo, Rusinga Primo, yeah, Primo Kidogo mm. Turi, yeah, yeah. Saint Andrews. Uh. Oh, uh, a mm. soul man show is your body. That's from which class to which class? That's class seven. Adin Kamalizo. Adin Kamalizo. Mm. Uh, Yo nini um kwani uh, maparol kona do nini why were you thrown to, <laughs> to boarding uh my okay so uh my father passed away when i was really young mm-hmm. and uh nilikuwa rusinga mm. and i don't know what happened you know I, I have one of those really protective moms something happened in rusinga she was unhappy yeah, yeah, about yeah. it and she mm. she took me to saint andrews eh? mm-hmm. yeah so walikuwa na do nini biz biz tu yeah, yeah. Biz. It's what oh. I even now till now what we do. It's, it's what we do as a family. We mm. run hotels. Oh, oh, oh. Mm. yeah. Mm. Okay. Which chain? The chain, no, chain actually, gang. Um. So we have uh, two hotels and uh, we have a, a rehab center that was started by my sister. Mm. One mm. hotel is in Thika. It's mm. called Cravers. The other one is here. It's called Roasters. 
Oh. Iro okay. stas ya nyama hii. Mm. Mm-hmm. 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 Okay. Mm-hmm. Okay. So even like back in the day they used to play a lot of lingala. Yeah. Mm-hmm. yeah. Mm-hmm. Uh, and I get a lot of influence, a lot of musical influence from mm. from Lingala. I, I, in fact, till today, I think Lingala music is the best yeah, yeah. in yeah. Africa. Mm. Yeah, yeah. It's number one, then now followed by... So the Congolese are number one, mm. followed mm. by the South Africans, mm. then the Nigerians, mm. then the Kenyans, mm. then Uganda, mm. then Angola. Hii time yote na ngoje sema TZ na wiki TZ. Ah TZ is maybe 10. Eh unaruka TZ? Cuz me if you are to ask me I feel like East African nuts are, are being held by TZ like this. Like they created this industry where we might have in quotes more talent but they have an industry. Those guys they believe the hype more than anyone else in 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 Africa. They believe mm. their hype. Yeah, That's what yeah. I give them. Mm. They mm. believe their hype. And once they believe their hype, yeah. bus. That's it. 